so as you all know that we have already finished the entire microeconomic syllabus now the question arises how should we go ahead and revise microeconomics after covering microeconomics once thoroughly my suggestion would be to go ahead and follow the following so what you have to go ahead and do is now every day you have to solve at least 10 questions from your microeconomics question bank i will be as you know we will be having this microeconomics question bank these will be the questions plus video solutions across different topics of microeconomics even if you know the answer to a particular question still look at the video it will help you revise the concept when i do a concept in a video when i do an answer in a video i will also very very shortly discuss that topic once so for example if the question is on pareto efficiency i will discuss what pareto efficiency is in the topic that will help you revise if you do these 10 questions every day with me believe me so imagine by the end of december you have done approximately 300 to 400 different micro economics question with me you can clear any entrance exam after that so that is the first thing that does not stop you from the other revision now after this you have to go ahead and do one chapter revision every day one chapter every day go through if reading is difficult for you then only from berian or snyder any one book do all graphs of that chapter dekho micro is all about graphs each graph in these books has an explanation as to what that graph is about and why that is drawn in the particular way for example if you see a graph related to the food stamp program something like this this is your new budget line suppose then in that graph only the explanation of the food stamp program will be given just below that graph similarly if you see a graph showing the substitution effect then in that graph only just below the graph you will see the explanation as to why that substitution effect happens in the way it happens what is point a what is point b what is point c i want you to go through all the graphs of one chapter in one day read through the explanation of that and at last do back questions of snyder that's it if you think doing back question of snyder is too much leave it it's okay i will cover whatever is important in my question bank anyways but this 10 question and reading one chapter per day this is very very important for the revision of microeconomics if you solve 10 questions every day if you're not taking the classes it's okay just pick up on any 10 questions every day and solve those 10 questions any 10 mcq questions tough mcq questions and do one chapter every day 
that will help you sail through any entrance exam. Okay, this is the strategy for microeconomics.